Hello guys, I'm back. Today I am here to talk with you about why recruiters refuse my resume or why my resume is not considered by recruiters or job position. My name is Jefferson Costa and I teach students, graduates and engineers how to work with chemical process engineering and plant design. Follow my profile and like this video to get hundreds of content related to chemical process engineering and plant design. Get a job is a very hard subject because there is no correct answer to any kind of uh, position that you get. Uh, what I, I want to say, there is no special formula for getting a job. This depends on a lot of circumstances, uh, a lot of things that must be uh, okay to you get a job. and. To be sincere, I am not good on getting a job. As you, if you know my story, I spent around one, half, one and a half year to get my first job as a chemical process engineer once I finished my graduation. And what I can get from the, that period of time was, first, I had lack of experience because I was just a graduate. And second, I was not good on doing connection. I was not good on doing relationship. And I believe today, I believe that the, the most important part to get a job is how to build relationship. Let's suppose you are a recruiter. You have a lot of people available to you. Do you choose which, any one of them to a job position? Which one you should consider to work with you? Most probably is not the one with the highest scores in the school because what is ta taught, what you learn in schools, university, and etc., is just a small part about what you need to do in your job. In your job, you need to do the technical part, and you find a small part of it in the university, but you need. Uh, most important is to deal with stress, is uh, to deal with pressure, to deal with people, and that is something that usually the chemical process engineer do not learn during the university time. And I have seen during my period of time in university that people that was able to build the relationship with others people to get or uh, Comfortable talking with other people were the, the people that get the first positions in selection, in job selection or in trainee selection on my time. And now, around 15 to 20 years later, I understand how important is the connection with people. So if you are a fresh engineer or if you want to shift from a position, from operations, from uh, process safety or from any other position to get a job in process engineering, I recommend you, of course, that you must have the technical knowledge, but it's very, very important first, my point of view, that you build, you strengthen your inner self you need to be confident that no matter what happens, you will get a job opportunity. There are techniques for that. You, have, you can have good thoughts. You can have visualization, the table of dreams with a job position that you would like, etc. So, in, in summary, you need to have vibrations that allows you to, to meet people in situations that will allow you to get a job. This is my belief. Another thing that is very important is that while you are looking for a job, uh, that you understand what is persuasion. Persuasion is a very important part when you are doing interview. Persuasion means that you are able to build connection. When you, you are able to do a report, rapport, when you are able to talk about subjects that, in, that is interesting for the person that you are talking to, not for you, uh, the chances to, to the person, to the interview likes you, your chances to get a job increases also. What I recommend you for getting a job in 2023. So first, 
is to uh, work better your inner self. If you are depressed or if you are not confident of getting a job in process design, uh, work on that to eliminate these, these bad feelings and build good feelings because the first, the first thing to have is confidence. Not overconfidence, is to have confidence that you will do your best to get a job in 2023. If you have this confidence now, you need to have the tools to, to match the opportunity with your preparation. And one of the tools to match the opportunity with preparation is to work in persuasion. So uh, there is a, a book very interesting, Persuasion, from Robert Cialdini, that I will strongly recommend you to, to read, because it talks about six fundamentals. Reading that, you will be able to develop better conversations, to, to, to be present what the person needs from, from you, or etc. Another book that I recommend also is How to Influence People and Make Friends from Carnegie, Dale Carnegie. It's very, uh, I believe that these two books is the essential ones that you need to start with developing this. And when you start uh, studying a little bit about persuasion, you will add to your resume and you will add to your profile Phrases, uh, contests that will increase the chances to your, your resume get uh, be notified. 